Hello, yes, mass immigration is destroying our unique scouseness. That's right. Those with their eyes open in this city can see it changing by the day. Whole parts of Liverpool now are being transformed. The scouseness is going, it's being lost. If one drives along Princess Road in Toxteth, right down Lodge Lane, Smithdown Road, Lawrence Road, Daining Road, Kensington, Shield Road, right down to West Derby Road even, you can see it changing by the day. And a lot of the immigrants that are now settling here are Muslims, right? And they practice the religion of Islam that couldn't give a toss about the Beatles, Bill Shankly, uh, Dixie Dean, or our two cathedrals, or our great city. They couldn't give a damn, right? Now, what is happening here, it's not on the same par as immigration we've had to Liverpool, say in the uh, mid-1900s with the Irish potato famine. You see, the Irish, Welsh, Scottish and English, it's that blend that's made what we now call a scouser. That unique blend is what is responsible for what, as I say, is known as a scouser. Yes, we had um, black seamen that settled in Toxta from, say, uh, Nigeria, Sierra Leone, but because there, was, there were only few in numbers, it didn't really pose any sorts of a threat. And also, most of them married Liverpool women. They had children who in turn married Liverpool women or Liverpool men. Uh, and before you knew it, they were more or less fitted in to Liverpool and its scousness. Though I must admit that until the 1981 Toxteth riots, the blacks in Toxteth were sort of kept in a ghetto. They were like ghettoised. And when you look back now, it's rather shocking when you think about it, but that's the way it was. Now, because there was so few of them, and because they married uh, local Liverpool women or Liverpool men, they blended in. It wasn't really a problem. What's happening now is totally different. Christ, walk around that Kensington. I drive around there most nights. And it's the League of Nations and the, the cohesive community that was once there is going. And before you know it, the Scousness will be going with it. Because they're not adopting the Scousness. And how can they? Being a Scouser is not just about being born in Liverpool. It's about your family going back generations, literally generations. That's what makes a Scouser it's like, let's put it this way, you couldn't replace Scousers with Geordies or Cockneys and vice versa. We're all unique. But what's happening to our city now? This is an onslaught. We are literally being displaced and our Scousers will go with it. And if you love Liverpool like I do, then you've got to stand up and do something about it. I don't have anything to do with Tommy Robinson, the EDL or National Action or any of the cranks that in, in most cases, the security services have set up. I have nothing to do with them. I am a serious political thinker and I am concerned about what's happening to my lovely city. And like I've said, if you go from Princess Road to Lodge Lane, Smithdown Road, Christ, have you been down Smithdown Road lately with the Romanian gypsies? Christ, what a hellhole, what a dump that is now. But that's another video in itself. Then you go right down to Kensington to Shield Road and the place is transforming overnight. We're going to lose our unique scousers, right? Because these new immigrants that are arriving now, they're not, they don't want to mix in. They don't want to, uh, they don't want to be scousers. They're imposing their culture, their ways, their language upon us. So it's a threat to our scousers, mass immigration. And if you feel passionate like I do, about my city, you're going to have to do something about this. Okay, thank you.